Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TrophyNet and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the Death March difficulty. We're still doing some uh, scavenging because today we're going to do the Superior Bear School gear. Uh, and we're here in uh, Valen again. Not uh, Skellige this time, we're in Valen. And uh, we're here at the Silver Sword Upgrade Diagram location. I'm going to show you quickly on the map. There we go. There's a ruined tower to the east of the Orphans of Crookback Bog. And that's where we're at right now. So that's right there in the swamp area, uh, as you can see. So yeah, pretty far down south. So let's take a look. So we have the uh, the symbol right here. I want to look around some. And then it points us towards some chests on the other side of the ruins here, if I'm not mistaken. So the the marker is pretty centered. So yeah, okay. There's a chest, I think. Easy peasy. There we go. Let's take. A rusty bread knife. Never mind. That was silly. Let's take a look around then. Oh, it's right here on the the eastern side of the uh, the ruins. There we have the Ursine Steel Sword Superior. There we go. That's part one. And now we'll head towards the uh, armor upgrade diagrams because I actually already found those. But I'll show you the location either way. So next up is the armor upgrade diagrams location. Because it's right here in a cave that I accidentally cleared out already. So let's show you on the map. So just northwest of Hangman Street, there's a monster nest right over there. I think I can't see it anymore because I cleared it out already. But it should be right over there. Let's take a look inside. I think if you go towards the left side of the cave, you should be able to find... Yeah, I think it's this chest that it's in. So... Uh, there you will find the armor upgrade diagram. So I took cat beforehand so you could uh, easily see this. So okay, so next up is a silver sword upgrade diagram and then we should be done already. I remember being scared of all these things in the in the swamp when we uh, first started this playthrough. Hard oh, good times. But the uh, silver sword upgrade diagram is in a cave right here uh, in the swamp. Right, right next to the, the orphans of Crookback Bog. Let's show you the map. So there we go to the uh, southwest of the Orphans of Crookback Bog. There should be a cave right here. You probably should have a marker as well, but I probably cleared that out already as once. Uh, although I never found this, hmm, the sign here apparently. I want to look around some. But might want to look around some. So let's take a look around indeed. Because this looks like a pretty big cave and the marker is pretty big as well. There seems to be a chest over here. That's not it already, but we do get a nice bit of supplies. Does look like a cave I once killed one of the contracts in. I think it was that special kind of foglet. Oh, there's another chest at the entrance. Look at that. Okay, exploding bolts and everything like that. And a silver sword superior. Thank you very much. So with that, we should be done with the quest, I think. Though we don't get the nice sound effect for that. I don't know what's going on with the water here as well. Because it seems to be higher than the ground. Weird. But let's head towards the blacksmith in Novigrad. And I'll see you guys there in a minute. So there we go. Back in Novigrad. Hello, Hattori, my friend. Can you help us out with a, uh, well, the bear school swords? Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Ibeer. How might I be of help? I bear? Craft something for Listen, me? Would you craft something for me? Some superior bear swords? So the earth sign steel sword superior, leather scraps, a diamond ingot, monster blood and monster claws. So no problem at all. Let's get that. And then the superior earth sign silver sword it took me a bit more time. Leather scraps, diamond ingot and for this one I had to jump into the alchemy uh, recipes. Albedo. And then a bit of monster hair. There we go. Silver Sword Superior. There we go. So long. Thank you, Hattori. So, let's head to Kraus Perch next. And uh, see what we can uh, get from Joanna to get uh, ourselves a, a nice bit of armor. So, the sun is setting over Crow's Perch. Looking at... Uh, well, it makes it look rather lovely. But hey, Joanna. Geralt, good of you to come by. Yes, indeed. We need some uh, need Witcher some armor. great armor. Witcher's armor. The superior earth sign boots, so the enhanced boots, hardened leather, a dark steel plate, two leather scraps and two monster claws. Easy does it. The superior earth sign armor set, uh, enhanced ar uh, armor of course, cure dragon leather, 
two diamond radium plates again monster essence and monster hide so let's craft it immediately there we go superior earth sign gauntlets leather scraps dark steel ingot a meteorite or well a piece of meteorite ore and uh, four monster teeth so there we go and then the trousers superior earth sign trousers silk hardened leather dark steel ingot and monster brain usually the easiest one to build and there we go so there we go thank you joanna take care now and let's see how that looks in the blazing sunlight over here maybe a bit too blazing let's put ourselves right here so quite the upgrade i'm gonna put myself right here so the gauntlets and the boots are now almost completely plated so they uh, have big metal plates on them so reinforced right over there the skirt is now uh, the gray part of the skirt has now completely taken over and we get a bit of a scarf right there look at that yeah so the uh, the centerpiece is also a bit different so those rings those metal rings were in there before as well on that uh, hard leather plate so there we go the bear gear and let's take a look at the swords Pretty simple as swords go, so pretty straight forward, but pretty, pretty powerful. And the sun is moving away from me. There we go. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed it and it helped you out a bit, don't forget to like this video right here on YouTube. And if you haven't already, don't forget to give it a thought to subscribe to my channel. Because I really, really appreciate any support you guys can give me. So thanks again enormously for watching and I hope to see you in the next video or series. Goodbye.